On the rooftop, baby. with this so I was like you know what I'm gonna try to do two things one test out the ZV-1 but also test out the wide angle lens adapter and then also I want to do a another content so I'm gonna do some other video uh, at some point later on today but anyways for now we just vlog baby I love the French press it's one of the easiest way to make solo coffee we actually have a coffee maker <laughs> but I uh, it's a lot easier so Coffee time. So I'm pretty much done with the video. I just finished shooting the B-roll for it. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let my friend Raymond know I'm done because she's supposed to come over and we're gonna, she's gonna cook some food. So I might record some footage of that when she gets here. But I'm gonna go ahead and start doing some laundry. I'm gonna start editing this video. So I'll get back with you in a few moments. You can see it's still hot, it's still quite, nothing changed. But I am um, done with the video. I'm pretty much done with the editing. I have to do a few more little final touches. Laundry's pretty much done. So yeah, it's time to chill, baby. Still have things to do, a couple of things. I need to go run to the store. Little things, little things, but yeah. All right, yeah, I go take this trash out. Now I gotta go grab some oil for Rima. She'll be here shortly, so. this macro lens real quick so let's see uh, we're gonna zoom in on the fish so reverse eyes if you are queamish all right so we're about to eat now so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up it's been a great experience from what I can see on the back of the camera. I tried a couple of different modes out, the high frame rate. I tried the interval shooting. I tried to do the macro with the newer lens. A little bit, I think everything I shot a little bit early in the morning and a little bit during the brightest parts of the day. I've already shown you guys what the low light looks like here. So, so I got two questions for you. One, what do you think of the ZV-1 as a vlogging camera? And two, what do you think about this wide angle lens adapter from newer? Man, I really want to break down what I feel about it, but I think I'll just wait until I do a full review of this CV-1 and or of this wide angle lens adapter. So yeah, when I see that, then yeah, I'll give you all the pros and cons. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll know it definitely. I'll know more once I see this. But until the next time, don't forget to subscribe and I'll talk to you guys on the next video.